we've been working hard to uh, be ready for our first human, and obviously we want to be extremely careful uh, and certain that that it will work well before putting a device in a human. But we're we've submitted, I think, most of our paperwork to the FDA, and we're, we're we think probably in about six months we should be able to have our first neural link in a human. So. Now this is a this this video is now 18 months old. So this is um, Pager, uh, who is playing uh, monkey mind pong. So this is a P Pager has a neural link implant in this video, um, and the, the thing that's interesting is that you you can't you can't even see the the neural implant. Um, so it's the it's. We've miniaturized the neural implant to the po point where it, it matches the the thickness of the skull that is removed. So it's essentially the it's sort of like having an Apple Watch or a Fitbit, uh, re re replacing a piece of skull with like a you know a smartwatch, <laughs> uh, for lack of a better uh, analogy. Um, so. Uh, so you can see, you really can't, it, it, he looks pretty, he's normal. But, um, and I, I think that's pretty important. If you have a Neuralink device, like I could have a Neuralink device uh, implanted right now, and you wouldn't, <laughs> you, you wouldn't even know. I mean, <laughs> hypothetically, <laughs> I maybe one of these demos, in fact, one of these demos I will. Yeah. This is Dan Dix here reporting for Press for Truth. UN warns brain chips like Elon Musk's Neuralink could be used as personality altering weapons as the FDA approves tech for human trials. A United Nations panel has warned that brain chip technology being pioneered by Elon Musk could be abused for neurosurveillance, violating mental privacy, or even to implement forms of forced re-education, threatening human rights worldwide.